Welcome to DEXIS IS ScanFlow Overview Video. In this overview video, we will cover the basic features of IS ScanFlow. Note, at any time during this training, please pause the video to complete the steps before moving on. Launch DEXIS IS ScanFlow. Sign in with your registered email address and password. If you do not have an account, click Sign Up and create an account. Click Sign In. The welcome window is displayed. Search or create a patient. Choose your patient. The patient information window is displayed. In the patient's information window, you can choose to scan, import a scan, or choose the intraoral camera to launch the intraoral camera. Note, this option is available for IS3800W Premium users only. Click Scan, the DEXIS IS ScanFlow window is displayed. DEXIS IS ScanFlow Overview In this overview, we will highlight some of the features to help familiarize you with the look and feel of DEXIS IS ScanFlow. In the DEXIS IS ScanFlow window, you have your title bar, which shows the patient's name. If someone is signed in, it shows the initials of who is signed in. If you click the initials, you can switch accounts or log out. Click here to start or stop record screen. This feature must be enabled in preferences. Click here to access the settings menu. Click here to minimize the DEXIS IS ScanFlow interface. Click here to close the DEXIS IS ScanFlow interface. The acquisition step displays the current step in the acquisition process. The imaging toolbar allows you to select and manage 3D images. The jaw and bite selector allows you to select upper or lower jaw or the buckle bite registration. Configure scan toolbar is used to select an acquisition mode and access specific tools for each mode. The 3D model display screen displays the 3D model created from the scan. The video preview screen displays live video while scanning the patient's teeth. The general toolbar allows you to change how the 3D model is displayed. Click the back icon to go back to the patient's information window. This icon displays the scanner status. Under the settings menu, you have the following options, tips, export, about preferences help tutorial videos if you have a software update you will see this option and if you are subscribed to a premium plan you will see this option in this lesson we will go over the preferences menu to access preferences click here to open the menu click preferences the Preferences dialog box enables you to select DEXIS IS ScanFlow interface and scanner settings. It is recommended to set up your preferences before using the scanner. Note, turn on your scanner prior to opening DEXIS IS ScanFlow to have all options available to edit. There are six preference categories, General, Device, Save, Scan, Color, and Tools. Here are the preferences that will be used daily. Under the General tab, you have the following options. Tips This option is used to view tips for certain features of the software. To enable or disable the tips, click here to toggle on or off. Software Language Click the drop-down arrow to choose your default language. Tooth Numbering System Select your tooth numbering system. Theme. Choose here if you want your background to be light, dark, or choose follow system if you are using the override background color. If you desire a contrast between your background and button colors, enable override background. After enabling override background, choose your background color. A warning message will be displayed if your color combination is not optimal for reading. Under the Device tab, you have the following options. Choose No Sound if you prefer not to hear a sound while scanning. Scanner Sound indicates a beeping sound is heard each time a scan starts and stops. One beep indicates scanning is in progress 
Two beeps indicate the scan has stopped, and you must rescan a previously scanned area to begin again. A single beep also indicates you have successfully captured a buckle bite while capturing the patient bite. PC sound, select to have a sound continuously play through your PC when you are successfully scanning. If the sound stops, the scanning stops, and you must rescan a previously scanned area to begin again. Click the drop down and choose your sound effect for your PC sound. To adjust the volume, click or drag the slider bar to increase or decrease the volume sound. Under the Save tab, you have the following options. Auto Save Quadrant Snapshots To enable or disable the save feature, click here to toggle on or off. Enabling this feature automatically saves Quadrant Snapshots in JPEG format for every scan acquired. Under the Scan tab, you have the following options. To enable or disable this extra byte capture feature, click here to toggle on or off. Enable extra byte capture if there are cases in which more than one byte registration is required. Examples could be protrusive, centric relation or open byte. Scan warning, which is routinely enabled, displays green lines and red arrows indicating areas of weak connections among tooth surfaces that might cause an image stitching error. Here is an example of scan warning. Gap warning, which is routinely disabled, displays in yellow, small areas of mismatched data. Here is an example of gap warning disabled and enabled. Highlight hole, highlights a boundary around areas missed in scanning, producing a hole as a result. This feature is routinely disabled when the background color is not enabled. Here is an example of highlight hole disabled and enabled. Enable shade matching if you plan to utilize the scanner as a shade guide. Select the shade matching library that you plan to use. Select the refine resolution default for your scans. Low resolution tends to be used for models. Standard is designed for appliances, and high is ideal for crown, bridges, and implants. Under the color tab, you have the following options. Hole filling routinely is enabled. The software manufactures data to fill in holes in the scan after refinement. The color displayed is based on the selection of hole filling color. To change the hole filling color, click hole filling color and select the desired color. Click OK to save. This is an example of hole filling disabled and enabled. Adaptive hole filling color. If enabled, the software uses a neighboring color to fill in a hole. Note, this option is only available when Enable HD3D and Enable Hole Filling is selected. Here is a visual of adaptive hole filling color enabled with HD3D selected. Under the Tools tab, you have the following options. Enable orthodontic simulation if you want the ability to demonstrate before and after orthodontic treatment results. Enable screen recording is routinely enabled. This feature records up to two hours of acquisition data as an MP4 file. This can be useful as a training aid, as well as a troubleshooting tool. Enable auto save screen recording if you want to automatically save a copy of the MP4 file. Click here to select where you want to save the MP4 files. Click the folder to open the folder containing the MP4 files. Click Save to save your preferences. Enable Live Video and Resizing the Live Window To activate the live video, pick up the scanner and press the power button for one second. If you would like to expand or shrink the live video window, grab the top left corner of the window and drag it out to expand it or drag it in to shrink it. This concludes the DEXAS IS ScanFlow Overview video.